Hi friends, Joanna here. How is everybody doing? I hope you guys are all doing amazing. Thank you again for all of your happy anniversary uh, wishes for us. Uh, we definitely have grown in the last year. Um, giving us a thumbs up, um, leaving a comment and subscribing definitely has been helping us to grow. So thank you guys so much. Um, super quick share today. Um, my husband and I went, did a day trip and did some antiquing for anniversary. Um, and I just want to show you, this is quick cause it's not that much stuff, but, um, let's see. Um, this is, we got, we went to, um, a place called the Emporium. It's down in uh, Point Pleasant, New Jersey. If you haven't been, they have, it's a beautiful town with beautiful um, antique stores, thrifting restaurants. You can eat, you know, um, on the bay. You can go to the beach. Really wonderful. I highly recommend it. And um, we've gone so many times and we've always found um, lots of stuff. It's not the cheapest stuff, like as if you were going to an estate sale, but definitely lots of fun. So first item on the list is I had gotten this watering can. Um, so awesome. It's actually a nice can. Um, let's see. It's pretty, has a pretty good weight to it. So, um, if you guys could comment and let me know what you guys think about the stuff that I had gotten, I would really appreciate it. That would be really helpful to us. So, yeah. Um, I'm not going to use this as a watering can. Obviously, it's probably just going to be decoration but so pretty and I have a couple of these already but this is the biggest one I found so far this um, spool this yarn spool this is definitely very old um, I've cleaned it up a little bit but might need a little bit more cleaning but this is pretty big and it's nice and heavy so this is um, a, a really nice decoration for my sewing room so this is definitely going into my collection. I have a few already, so. Um, <clears throat> I also have a few of these already. These um, uh, um, these will go on to the big yarn machines, the spinning machines, right? So I never had a red one before, so this is pretty, pretty neat to have. <clears throat> Excuse me, I do have a few of these already. And I have gotten this fabric too. This is really, um, this is a yard, and it's like a um, crepe fabric. Um, I am thinking how cute this would be for a purse, like a handbag, you know, like a tote or um, like a shoulder bag, right? There's not enough fabric to make a shirt, definitely not. But if you guys have any ideas, please, please comment because I would love it. Um, so, yeah. Look how pretty that is. Very vintage, super fun. And I have this, I've gotten this, um, I have, love this, love this. This actually matches quite nicely, right? Um, I save some old uh, ribbon spools so I can, you know, tie these around, but look how pretty that is, right? This little ribbon little embroidered flowers so pretty so awesome so I'm not sure if this if there was more of this fabric you could make a pretty shirt and then do you know like pretty little um, hemline for this ribbon here so um, so cool it matches so nicely right so that's it for um, our today's finds. I just want to share this with you. Super fun. If I can't share it with you guys, then who am I going to share it with, right? Um, it's better to share things with friends than uh, not being able to share it with anybody. So, um, yeah, please comment. Let me know what you guys think. I'm so excited about the, this, this trim. So awesome. Yeah, so let me know what you guys think for any ideas for this, because, I mean, whenever I've asked for ideas, I've gotten lots of cool cool ideas, but... So keep in mind, there's only a yard of this, and, um, I don't know, no, but... All right, 
Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Give some ideas, comments, like, give a thumbs up, subscribe. Um, it's uh, really been helping us a lot to grow. So um, I will be talking to you guys soon. Thank you so much.